too late. Engine is already here. What do we do? Stop the truck. What's even down there? My home. Dusk, stay out of this. Wait! Call! Rodko! Rodko, they've cleared our northern line. They have an exo. We'll take care of the wounded later. We have to stop them. Let's go! Move! <laughs> Tell me, where's Adana? Don't worry, Cahal. Your daughter didn't fight this battle. How are your wounds? Riddled with silver. It'll take days to heal. But things would have been far worse if you hadn't stepped in. I just did what I had to do. Nothing more. I honestly never thought I'd see your face again. Why'd you come back, Cahal? I was worried about Adana. When I heard the Cairn was being targeted, I had to come back for her. You know I couldn't stay. Not after what I did to Rafiq. I told you that your rightful place was at my side. And what you had done could be forgiven. But no. You chose to abandon us. Me, the Cairn, your daughter. Where is she, Rodgo? With Ava. Working undercover at the biggest entrance site in the Pacific Northwest. The best option available to us after the failure of our last mission. Rodka, you let Adana infiltrate Andrin? My fucking daughter? After what happened with her mother? Your daughter is the best undercover agent I have. We will not win our fight for Gaia without first bringing Indran down. And with your daughter on the inside, we're closer than ever. She may not fight like we do, but she's every bit as strong. You should respect that. The work she's doing inside Indran is absolutely vital. More so after what their private fucking army just did to us. I'm afraid her work won't be able to stop Indran from retaliating against us. Not after our last mission. Your last mission? What do you mean? You remember the old abandoned mine not far from here? Hendron bought it and turned it into a training center for their new recruits. I launched an attack to wipe them out, but Tank Girl stopped us. The woman you saw in the exo during the attack, she drove us back. Tank Girl, you call her. I encountered her during my last mission. She was trying to buy silver bullets from an arms dealer. That's where I learned she was planning an attack on the Cairn. Major Grainer. That's the name her men give her. 
but to us, she's Tank Girl. And she leads Endron's troops with about as much grace. Their attack on the Cairn was their first wave of revenge for our attack on the training center. We managed to repel them this time, but it's only a temporary victory. They might return at any moment, and Endron just keeps recruiting soldiers. Then we've got to go back to the mine and destroy their training center. It's the only way to buy the Cairn any sort of safety, no matter how brief. Go back? No. Not until I'm well again. Then we can strike. I'll take care of that goddamn training center myself. You know I can handle it on my own. No. You're no longer a part of this pack. It's my responsibility. And how long will it take for you to get better? Days? Weeks? If they return, the cairn will fall. Huh. I'll think about it. Go pay your respects to your Fen and come back to me. Then we'll talk about the mine. The cairn is in a bad way. didn't even know how to fight. He was a spirit healer, a caretaker of children. Endrin doesn't show anyone mercy, and we won't either. It has been many a year since I last felt your presence, warrior of Gaia. It's been nearly as long since anyone called me that. Your care needs you, and the wild has need of your protection. The Eater of Souls is fighting with all his might to take control of it. And he is winning. The corruption takes many forms. But the effects are always the same. You must help us fight back. I came back to find my daughter. Have you seen her? Ah, Adana. A dear friend and always respectful of nature. You fear for her safety then? She too is fighting for Gaia in her own way. But do not worry. You both walk the same path. You will find each other in time. To fight your battles, you will need power. Power I can provide by helping you develop your warrior gifts. Thank you, Ifen. You may find lost spirits during your travels. Return them to me. And I will be able to strengthen your natural abilities. One last request before you depart. Many of your kin fell in combat. I would ask you to bury them. You will find their bodies both inside and around the cairn. Your penumbra vision will show you the way. Soothe their souls and send them to me, so that they may travel to the wild 
without being captured by the worm. I will if I can, but my priority is Endrin's training center. Weaken the forces of the worm there, but never forget your brothers and sisters. Gaia needs you. Ghost changed his mind. Ceres? But how? She was in the back, tending to the wounded. It's all my fault. I had a sniper. Dusk, what are you doing here? I thought I told you to keep clear. You really thought I'd leave you behind like that? You should know me better than that by now. Besides, looks like you need all the help you can get. I really don't want to lose my front row tickets to the Cajal show. Thanks, Dusk. Okay, yeah, no. Thanks sounds real weird coming out of you. Put that shit away. Well, if you really want to help. I'll go look after the injured. I rang the weather stormers and asked them to lend us a hand, too. Don't worry about me. You just do what you gotta do. I went to see Fen. He's gotten so weak. Please, Rotko, let me help you. Let me deal with this training center. Why is it that you care now, Kahal? We were so easy to ignore when we went right in front of you. What? You want to be part of the pack again? I want to help the pack. I want to protect Adana. But you don't intend to rejoin us. I've already given into rage and killed one of our kin, Rotko. I can't take the risk of doing it again. You already know I disagree. Nonetheless, we are united by those we mourn. So I'll accept your help. So what can you tell me about this so-called training center? Ava managed to get a hold of the mine blueprints to help us prepare for our previous attack. The site's weak point is its power supply. They apparently haven't had the time to give it a proper upgrade. The whole thing is powered by one big propane tank, just like it was when it was a mine. I see. So if I blow up the tank, the whole mine will cave in, taking the training center with it. Then we'll need explosives. You'll be happy to know I didn't come back empty-handed. I'm aware. I met your new friend, uh, Dusk, right? He gave me the explosives you two stole. You've still got a problem, though. You don't know the layout of the site, and I'm too injured to go with you. Huh. I don't like touching the stuff, but I suppose I'll use Ava's radio equipment to guide you. That should do the trick. Perfect. So we'll stay in radio contact. Take the explosives and go. Good luck, Kahal. Dusk, my friend, I owe you one. My son! They killed my son! He's lost a lot of blood. I don't know if he'll make it through the night. Has anyone told his wife yet? She... She's gone. She bled out just before they shot him. Hey, Kahal. It's good to see your face again. Those assholes show themselves, just fire. Do not hesitate. They're currently recruiting at their training center. Then perhaps I need to enlist.
have a security breach. to Andrin and the Worm. Death is a blessing. You should see a command post overlooking the waiting room. You'll have a computer inside and a service door leading into the mine. That computer will allow you to open the service door and cut communications with the lower floor. The people in the training center will have no idea what's going on just above their heads. <laughs> 